What's going on guys? Welcome to a new game here on the channel. Today we're going to be checking out some Dungeon Tycoon. This is a new uh, prologue of a game that actually is supposed to be coming out later at the end of the year. And uh, this one just released about a month ago actually. We missed this. Uh, looks like a fun little game. Found it randomly on Steam. Just browsing around on stuff and um, see, what we, see what we can... I guess uh, figure out what this and have some fun with it. it. Looks like I said, looks like a fun little game. I used to play a ton of tycoon games when I was younger and everything, so this looks right up my alley. Kind of a, again overhead shot with a tycoon style game with all of this, and looks kind of like a Minecraft ish meets tycoon uh, simulator kind of thing. But anyways, if you guys enjoy this and want to see some more of this, be sure to drop a like in the video, show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around here checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But without further ado, let's hop right into it. Ooh, we got a dungeon name. You guys already know we're, we're going to do our old old faithful. We're working on it. All right. And then looks like all we can do is normal. We got our tutorial. We've got just one map that we can do. So it looks like there's different maps, different difficulties and stuff that we can check out here in the full game. But um, you guys can, kind of, like I said, kind of see it look, almost looks like a Minecraft kind of game. Uh, welcome, Master. I'm delighted to see that you are finally awake. It has been quite lonely here without your presence. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I see we gotta move this out of the way a little bit. I don't know if that's gonna be in the way, in the way of the uh, tutorial here still or not, but place is a total mess, I know, but I have no worries. We can fix it. We'll start attracting delicious adventures in no time. Uh, don't know if we're on the same, um, I guess, end goal of things here, Mr. Spider. Uh, let's start off by building a door. You can you can do that by clicking on the build button on the lower left corner. Okay, so down here. Then just select the door tab and choose a door you like. I said a door way too many times. Okay. Um, so it looks like that is actually our face cam is still in the way of the tutorial of this. There we go. So we need to select a door here. Ooh, we got wooden door and dungeon door. I guess we'll do the wooden door. What's the difference? I guess this is, yeah, a much bigger one with that. Can we, oh, we can rotate around like traditional like tycoon games. I guess let's try and do that like right in the middle there. Next, let's build a chest to store the loot of fallen heroes or monsters. Okay. Um, I guess it's probably going to be this guy right here. Oh, yeah, wooden chest. Okay. Again, this kind of feels Minecrafty-ish. Nice job. Now let's build a spawner so you can summon me um, to deal with the filthy adventurers who dare step into your mighty dungeon. Go to the spawners tab and build a small spawner. Okay, Mr. Spooderman. What do we got going on then? So we've got to build a spawner. Monster spawner, small spawner. Guess we probably... Or do we want that inside? I guess... Oop. I'm pushing the wrong keys. I guess we want that inside of... I you would think this would be like our safe space here. But I guess that's where we want them to be. Very nice. But right now, I, but right now even I can't hardly see anything. Let's light up the place and build some torches. Okay, so we do want it inside there. Go to the light tab and build two wall torches. Okay. Light sources, wall torch. Again, this feels very Minecrafty-ish. Uh, nice job, master. I know you still only had it. Now get out of build mode and assign me to the spawner. You can do that by clicking on the spawner and then clicking on the change tab. Okay. I do want to build a couple more of these torches here. Wait, what? Please build the correct object to continue. Oh, we can't even... Okay. Well, I guess we can't... I can't. I guess we can't do that here. Uh, but we need to get out of build mode, which is going to be right there. And then let's... Assign a spawner here. Change. There we go. We got a crawler. Finally, this feels amazing. <laughs> now you can decorate the dungeon to your liking. Time for some research. Start your first research. And I, you can do that by clicking on the book icon in the, on the upper left. And then clicking on the research mode. Okay. So this looks interesting. We got our book up here. Research that we can do. Oh, we got, okay. Got some potion business. Don't forget to look at the quest panel. Upper left corner of the screen. Uh, start the day whenever you are ready, upper right corner of the screen. So we've got, I guess we can exit out of that. We've got our research, finances, quest. We have finances here. That's interesting. We've got an overview of everything. Satisfaction. Okay, we got that. 
Uh, so five potions, research one items in the research tree. So that's our next quest that we need to do here. Um, research, which do we have? Oh, we do have other stuff. Uh, unlocks respawn pedestal. Okay, so we got our Mr. Spooderman here. We go ahead and start our day here. Now let's wait for the first visitor. Okay, we can just observe the dungeon. Can zoom in here and see. See, I just want to put another torch right here and then maybe one above the door. But it looks like that's not going to happen. I just noticed that's also not centered. Like I thought that was. Oh. <laughs> oh, sorry. I guess I was too rough on them. When heroes die, they get really annoyed and that can affect your dungeon's popularity, popularity neg negatively. But hey, you've earned a soul. You can use that to do really cool stuff. Anyways, let's try this again. So Mr. Spooderman here is just going to be here unliving people. I also don't know what this guy is. I don't know what this thing is. Right here. Oh, it's like a little... Oh, they pay, they pay to come in here? Oh, okay. So he actually took down Mr. Spooderman. Uh, but you see how happy the adventurer got. Building a dungeon is all about optimizing fun so the heroes keep coming. Make sure to strike a good balance between keeping them happy and annoying them with cheeky traps. Interesting. I guess you're ready to run your own dungeon now. Don't forget striking a good balance is key. Good luck, my lord. Are you out, my guy, or are you just going to be here then? Chilling out. I guess he just keeps spawning. And here's like our rating here for all of this. So we need to get... Ooh, okay. This is definitely interesting. A little less, I guess, like simulator-esque and more tycoon. Kind of just like chill back and play. He was slain again. Um, extract gold. Oh, okay, we got wooden chest. So we can lock it and unlock it. We can extract, I'm assuming, yeah, that's going to be souls. Oh, it takes some time for them to spawn in. I see. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Can destroy, summon new ones. We can rename. Ooh. Spooderman. <laughs> I like it. Um, oh, did we? Oh, we paused. I don't know why that paused, or stayed paused at least. What is going on here? Do we need to, like, I guess we're working on researching here by getting some of these visitors coming in. We got a new one spawning in another 12 seconds, so we need to, like, hold them here, I guess. Can we, like, shut the door or, like, lock the door at all? Oh, I see. There's a little bar there that loads around as we uh, as we go too. Okay. Seems interesting. I feel like you guys are gonna like this game. I don't know. For whatever reason, I feel like it's like up right up the channel's alley with uh, this kind of game. But let me. Oh. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of this. If you guys do want to see some more of this here too. We need two visitors left to do some research. Yeah, this spider, Mr. Spooderman, is just not standing a chance here <laughs> with all of this. Can we, like, increase... Go oh, patrol? What? He's about to spawn in here, too, if this guy can hang out for just a moment. There we go. Hmm, okay. So we have one visitor left. And then we'll unlock another research point here, I guess. Got main page. Any other? No, I don't want to cancel. I didn't mean to. Oh, there we go. Completed. Finish the day to unlock. Okay. So we can go ahead and go ahead and end the day, I guess, once he's done just. Sword in this guy. So we can go ahead and end the day there. Yes. Okay, we got 20 gold, I think, out of that. We got another re got a research completed. You unlocked a potion dispenser. The potion, potion dispenser allows visiting heroes to purchase potions whenever they need a quick heal. Okay. Um, darker rooms will cause heroes to walk and act slower. Okay, that's good to know. Um... So, it looks like we've got a new quest. 
Hey, sir. Oh, right there. Completed. We can collect that. Now we got some more gold. That's actually really nice. I'm sure. We got to sell five potions, which we need. Oh, we got... Okay. More rooms. Attack totem, which unlocks a magic totem that boosts nearby heroes' attacks. Unlocks a camping spot for heroes to stay a while and rest. But don't we want, I mean, more of more souls, though, too? Hmm. Okay. Um... Unlocks a magic totem that boosts nearby. I guess maybe that would be helpful for us. I don't know. I'm not too sure with that. Okay. Let's go ahead and start up day two and see what happens. I don't know if we want to make the room darker for one. I guess we can get another spawner, can't we? What if we're to... Oh, can we not go into build mode? Well... Oh, I just realized. I don't think we even started. Shoot. I think we just messed it up. Well, dang it. Okay. Let's actually go ahead and end off the day there. Yes. Because I want to go into build mode here. Uh, what? Oh, there we go. Okay. So we've got another room that we could do here. Um, here's our vendor. Oh, potion dispenser. Okay. So we forgot to put, place this down in. I guess let's do that. Can we do like another monster spawner here too? Get a second spooder man in here. Uh, we got decorations, miscellaneous objects. We got more doors. We got tra ooh, traps. We can set. Can we just like do that? <laughs> just place a couple of them right at the front of the door there and see what happens. Okay, so we got the potion thing. We got another. Honestly, could we do another one like that? And then. Oh, we got to actually purchase a new one. I see. Okay. So we need 25. So we could choose one here. This looks interesting. Okay. So we actually picked a good one there. We got pretty good damage and actually the most health out of that. So we've got... Um, I don't even know what this... Mad Bear Pig. Oh, we actually need... We need... Oh, shoot. I think we actually need... Wait. Do we have... I think we need 10 more souls. Wait, maybe not. Okay, I don't know what we were... I don't know. I'm not really sure what we're doing here with this. Um... Oh, this guy had 20 of the gob. Okay. We got a giant bat. Okay. I like it. So, and then we can assign him right there. And there we go. Now we've got some other monsters. We've got some traps. We've got the potion things. Let's go ahead and start up our day here. Then now we don't just have Mr. Spooderman. Let's see what we got going on. We got more people coming in. We do. Okay. Got a low rating still. What? Oh, they took damage right away. Oh, he's going for the potion. Oh, we got another soul there. Okay. This is interesting. I like this. And see, now they're they're still good here. I like the little traps that we got going on. Oh, here's our next, our next guy coming in. Okay. I don't know if people stand a chance, honestly, against them anymore. We might need to get some better, um, better people in here now. Yeah, see, he's already... Oh. <laughs> okay. Can we see status? Okay. So 
we might be it might be too difficult to people might actually get upset at us here too at the same time I don't know I think these guys are gonna start losing health though too at the same time but they're gonna respawn fairly quickly too if we, yeah see they do t they do have some damage but they're also re actually they're healing up okay so I don't know we got this guy coming in though it's a fire wizard okay Okay, he didn't stand a chance, <laughs> I thought. I thought he was at least going to maybe put up a fight. We got uh, anybody else? Okay, we got people still coming in, though, so that's good. Is there's... Oh, okay, so this must be, like, the different levels of them here. See that star ring on the top? That's the prestige level of the dungeon. It'll fill with a purple color and as we build more and more impressive things in the dungeon. Uh, your prestige level. Okay. So we need to, I guess, increase our level. Wait, is that the... Okay. Yeah, they, they don't stand a chance now. We are just destroying them. <laughs> so that must be... Yeah, that's this. Okay. So we need to increase this as we go, which will unlock higher tier people for us. Which I guess this is the amount of people that are still on their way, ready to come in. Okay. Yeah, we can't go in build mode while our day is going on. Um, but we can collect this and collect some mushrooms. I don't know what that does for us. But, oh, we haven't sold a single potion yet. Oh, wait, do we need to actually do something with the... No? It's just they can't get to it, I guess, in time. Yeah, we need to, like, move it closer over here or something, I think. And for them to be able to access it. Okay. So we got two, yeah, two people left. Then. Okay. She's coming in now. Got another 10 coins from that. But yeah, I think we're gonna move this closer to like over here or something. May honestly, I might remove those traps. Oh, there we go. We got a potion. Wait. Maybe we have sold some and we... Is that still just that? I don't know. Wait, is that a sink in a... Oh, in one day? Okay. So yeah, just hold 12 in one day. So I think we only had like 10 or so here today. Giant bat. It's taking out too many heroes. Okay, what do we need to do then? Oh. Okay. Um. Oh, we got one more still. Nope, that's it. Oh, wait, we got another person here. Okay, I don't... I'm not sure what uh, that number... Or is this the last one, then, maybe? Oh, okay. Yep, so that's it right there, then. Um... So, we need to... We have a heal, we just can't make use of them. So we need to, I guess, remove. Um, I just want to... just want to move this out of the way. Oh, there we go. So we can push R to rotate right there then. Let's actually remove these traps. So we actually get some money back. Um... Object is not reachable. Oh, did we stick this? Okay. There we go. So... Do we want to do another bigger room here? I mean, I think we have an 8x8 eight eight right now, don't we? So, I guess there's that. Try to build up another room there. We can get a door. Can do like two doors there. So they can kind of loop around if they need to or something. And then maybe another... I don't know. Maybe another healing thing here. I think we're going to take out one, one of the monsters here. We're going to take out the bat here. On a sign. There we go. That way we can have, I guess, somewhat of a chance. 
for them. We need to make some more coins here, though. So let's get let's get another day going here and see what happens with all this. Can we assign somebody mid? Oh, we can assign somebody midday if we want to. Okay. Maybe they'll stand a little more of a chance. Let's grab a heal. Ooh, okay. He was actually really close there to be able, be able to use it. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, though. This is, It's going to be, I guess, a little bit tricky trying to find a balance here with this. I just realized we didn't get any lights in here. Is this guy going to stand a chance here? Uh, maybe not. Hmm. Oh, we are, he actually took one of them out, though. This guy might actually stand a chance, then. Oh, he did. Okay. So he just took our loot, some of our loot there. He's healing up, getting ready for another fight. Okay, now we gotta take him out. Hmm. Oh, now we got another one that's actually going to be fighting to get. Okay, what's going to happen now? They're just going to keep taking them out and taking our loot then, aren't they? Oh, wait, he just left. Okay, so it's only like two at a time then. This might be a bit of an issue then, though. <laughs> we might keep losing this. Oh, I think he's healing up. Oh, maybe not. Our spider, our spooder man, though. Okay, we might have made this too easy now with having multiple people here. Hmm, maybe we do need a third one. Actually, we can just assign that right now. And then they'll be able to spawn in. Okay, that kind of works. Because, yeah, we're just getting... Destroyed at this point. Having way too many people winning at this. Okay, there's our bat friend. Oh. Are you leaving now? You're still you're still chilling here for another round. Yeah, this was not our best day <laughs> with this. Uh, potion dispenser has ran out of stock. I don't know how we refill it. Yep, sorry, there's no, no potions for you. <laughs> okay. We got, uh, one left in there for you. Oh, now, okay, this could get a little interesting. We got a second one coming back in. You got Mr. Spooderman. And then Mr. Batman. Oh, and they are out of potions. Come on, take him out. Oh, dang it. I thought I thought we were going to actually win that time. Oh, we're finally getting a little bit of a better raid, though. People are starting to enjoy this, I guess. Okay. Yeah, this guy almost got taken out there. Okay, we're going to have, like, all three together, though, here real soon. I think we're going to start doing some winning here now. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right. There we go. We got a little bit back there. Oh, what have we got going on here? Re oh, research complete. You have a camp unlocked a camping spot. Um. Oh, we can increase our entrance fee. I didn't realize that we could do that. How do we do that even? Is it in finances? I don't see that. Let's collect that. We're almost there to that. Um, research. Wooden decoration. Okay, so that'll increase our... Ra oh, decorations will increase our ratings as well. Where's our camping spot that we unlocked? We can sell some of the souls for... Okay. Oh, camping. Right there. Duh. Um. Hmm. 
Sure, we could do that, I guess. Oh, okay. Oh, is that just a thing that we can do, I guess? Just any time. We don't, it's not something we have to actually unlock. I guess we just kind of screwed that one up, but that's okay. We collect some more coins there. That's good. Let's take a look at what's new real quick. So, camping spot. Right here. A co so, I guess we could probably put this over here. Like that. Let's also get a torch in there, too. Hmm. So decorations, I get. Oh, that's what the mushroom thing was. Then I see. We can put that there, and let's do a couple of mushrooms around here. I guess try to get our rating up a little bit here for that. Okay. So I think that's gonna be a good point to wrap up with this first episode. Like I said, if you guys do want to see some more of this, be sure to drop a like in the video, show it some love and support. And if you guys are new around, you're checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But like I said, if you guys do want to see some more, leave me a comment as well so I know what you guys think of this. And uh, if you guys want to see either some more of the prologue of this or if you want to see some more of the full game when it uh, releases sometime later this year, it says it just says Q4 of this year, which could be I guess actually at what any you know it'd be ne starting next month yeah starting next month is uh, the start of q4 but um yeah like i said that's gonna do it for this one guys so thank you all very much for watching i hope you all enjoyed and i will see you on the next one peace out guys